All right, we are back with My Happy Marriage, episode nine. Things are starting to get intense now. Things are starting to get actually like very serious. And it has me a little bit worried, uh, to be honest. So before we get into this, man, like always, uh, subscribe if you already aren't. Like, leave a comment, all that good stuff, man. And let's just get right into this episode. Yeah, I forgot they left off and she... Oh, I got saved by this... <clears throat> scumbag yeah like see like him you see you need to be careful like uh, you know uh, i don't like him i don't like him at all he's very sus all right well looks like he came back home i'm telling you her powers are starting to awaken mm. okay it's starting to, i'm starting to realize and see what, what, he, what he's talking about yeah, she probably, she probably doesn't even know shit about her, her like, her mother's side of the family. That cute dog. That cute-ass dog. Oh! He's getting ferocious now. Where's one of the grotesqueries? Oh, three of them. Three of the kamikaze ghosts. Damn. Alright, that's the first victim. Yeah. Damn. It's nah. That's, that's bad. That is horrible. It's even worse because like, after like when she's having her nightmares, he's no one's home, from what it looks like. Oh, she's getting bags under his eyes. That's lies. That's lies. Something going up. Something going on with you, and I know you're not, you ain't that good. Oh, he's gonna try to wipe him out in one go. Oh, it's about to get crazy now. Damn, that does look good. What the hell? Why she just pass out right now? <laughs> See, that's that's the girl dinner. That should be ate on a daily basis. She's a horrible. She's a horrible cook. Hey, Mio. That sounds like a. Uh, a little segue for you to help her teach her how to cook. Damn, that's kind of... Oh, that's sad. Damn, that's, that's pretty sad. Yeah, that's, a pretty, that's a pretty hard thing to envision, to be honest. But, you know, you can probably get like a little grasp of it, of what you want. You know? Oh my, that's so cute. Oh, it's so cute, man. Oh, that was so beautiful. Hmm. Damn, I'm trying to hunt down the, the Usubas, bro. His hair is sick, dude. His hair is sick. Yeah, she seems fun, dude. Your sister seems very fun to be around. Oh, that's good that you have a, you have a good relationship with your sister. <gasps> Oh, there's two cats and two kittens. Oh my god, there's two kittens. That's also cool, man. Having a good relationship with your with your sibling. Oh my god. He's taking the offense. He's taking the offense. Oh. Oh, he said, he said, he's throwing caution to when he's letting all his emotions be known. All his feelings be known. Stop trying to guard yourself, Mio, man. You're okay now. Like, you're in good hands now. You're in good hands. And, and, like, whatever you do is not going to bite you back. You know what I'm saying? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. I don't like him. I don't like to see him at all, this little rat. Scumbag. You better, you better get your ass home, bro. You better bring your ass home. Yeah, you, you. She does look exhausted, but what are you? What are you trying to achieve right now? What are you trying? What are you trying to? What are you trying to achieve right now? Try to put some, put a plant in her head. I mean, a see a, a bug in her head. You know what are you trying to? What are you trying to do, bro? What are you trying to? What are you trying to get in her head for? Dude, oh, I don't. Hold up. Nah, nah, nah. nah. Yeah, you better get your ass on, dude. But I feel like he planted a... I don't know what he did, dude. I feel like that that, that hand touch right there caused some... 
All right, Mia, what you got to do right now is tell Kudo what just happened. Tell Kyoko what just happened right now. And that piece of paper, I don't like either. Oh, let's go. He gets to do whatever he want. This guy, this guy is playing, this guy is playing crazy mind games, dude. Now he's gonna try to start some shit and put some more stress on, on Kyoko, bro. This guy knows how to manipulate crazy, dude. That guy's, he, you, you right there are a certified scumbag, bro. Well, that's definitely an Usuba. Oh. Oh. So that's, oh wow, so that's what they probably wanted, they wanted Usuba too. Close the damn door behind you, bro. That, it's kind of weird just seeing her, just seeing her standing looking lost. She does look worn out. You can't say that, dude. You can't say you thought you were right, dude. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta, oh, come on, you gotta reach out. Damn. Yeah, that was fucked up of you. Damn, she just collapsed like right there. Ah, oh, shit. It's oh no, it's starting to get bad. Oh, it's starting to get bad now. Oh no. Oh no, no, he's gonna see that she got a. Oh fuck. Oh no. All right, that episode it it ended up horribly, man. That that ah oh, that was that was hard to see. That was sad to see how it ended with Mio passing out and them just getting into an argument beforehand and like the, the last words she hears before she, I, I guess, just, I don't know, just goes unconscious are just cruel cool words that reminds her or that Kyoka said that, that, she, that it's like her old, it's how the whole old family she was with treated her. You know, now he's going to go look for that rat, that little scumbag and try to end it once and for all. He, he's definitely fallen into that trap of that other dude, of the, the scumbag, from what it looks like. Seeing that there's possibly an Usuba in that household too, I don't know how that's going to kind of work out. If Mio's, like if Mio comes into contact with another Usuba, I don't know like, if that's going to affect her in some way, shape, or form. And I don't know, is this next episode actually but it's probably going to be insane because now that the grotesqueries are starting to make their way towards the towards civilization, like they already have, I guess, one toll, you could say. Like they already got one person. Uh, something's going to explode. I feel like it's like, there's a, I feel like it, what it reminds me of is there's a crack in the dam right now. There's literally a crack in the dam and water starting to, you know, spew out and the crack is getting bigger. Like I, there's, there's something's going to have to give within these next couple of uh, these next couple episodes and it's it's going to be bad. It's going to be I don't know what bad but it's just going to be very intense. That's all I know. So we're just going to end off there. And like always man, subscribe if you already aren't I'm trying to get 500 before winter and I know we got that. Don't forget to like, comment, all that good stuff. So I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you all in the next one.